All right, in this video, I want to do an example uh, of a word problem involving averages, and maybe a, kind of a situation that you have found yourself in. Uh, so suppose you know you've taken four quizzes in your class, and your quiz average so far is an 82 out of 100, or an 82 percent. And maybe you're trying to bring your percentage, your quiz average, up to a 90 percent. Suppose you have six quizzes left, and you want to know you know, what should be your average score on each of those remaining six quizzes to bring your average up to a 90%. So again, uh, a couple different ways to go about doing these. Again, to find an average, you simply add up again um, all the individual values and divide by the number. So in this case, you know, the way I think about it is, well, you made an 82 on quiz one, and an 82 on quiz 2, and an 82 on quiz 3, and an 82 on quiz 4. So maybe you didn't make an 82 on all those, but your average was an 82. So in a situation like this, you can simply assume that they all are 82s. Likewise, you know, your, your last grades could be, you know, maybe you make a couple hundreds, and then you make a 92, who knows. But we can assume that you make uh, that they're all the same, your last six scores. So you're going to have six more quizzes to take. So we'll let x represent the average value um, on a quiz that you're going to have to have to make. So at this point, well, we've got ten things, ten quizzes, so we would have to divide this by ten. But again, we want this average to equal a 90. Okay, so we've got our, our average of 10 things on the left side, namely our 10 quizzes. And again, we simply want that to equal a 90. So this is now the equation that we're going to have to solve. So certainly in the numerator, you could have, you could have, uh, you know, you don't have to write all this out. We could have said you, you know, you've got four quizzes at 82 each, plus another six quizzes that you scored x points on each. So I'm just combining my two terms here in the numerator. You know, maybe you took, you know, 100 quizzes. You obviously wouldn't want to write all of these individual values out. So you made 482s and you got six quizzes left at we don't know how many points. That's what we're trying to figure out. So if you take 4 times 82, that's going to be 328 plus 6x. We've still got our 10 in the denominator. And again, we want that to equal 90. So now, you know, kind of a, a linear equation, hopefully not too bad to solve. I want to get rid of this 10 in the, in the uh, denominator, so I'm simply going to multiply both sides by 10. So on the left side, that would simply cancel it out, and we've got 328 plus 6x. So 90 times 10 would be 900. So the next thing I would do is subtract the 328 from both sides. So minus 328 minus 328. So we have 6x, I believe this would be what, 572? Okay, so the last thing we need to do is just get x, and again, x just represents the average score we're going to have to make. So if we simply divide by 6, divide by 6, we'll be left with x on the left side, and I'm going to uh, take the calculator shortcut here, 572 divided by 6 gives you 95.3 repeating. So it says you're going to have to make on average a little bit over a 95 percent on your remaining six quizzes to bring your average up to a 90 percent overall.